my friends. This is Proof Weight Loss Surgery Works, and I'm your Sunday blogger, Rosemary. Welcome. Okay, today's question. How do you define success, and what are some of your key factors that have led and continue to lead to your success? Well, what is success? An accomplishment. I have accomplished in 10 years uh, to be healthy. Uh, I've learned that for one thing, and this might be number one throughout this whole conversation, I learned that my journey was mine and only mine. That others were not doing it better than me. That I was doing me as best as I could. You know that quote that I, that I quote at the end of almost all my videos? Being the best me. I found out that I had to be the best me that I could be. Because what was working for others wasn't really necessarily working for me. Mathematically, maybe it should have, but it wasn't. And that's reality. Some people want to argue with that. You know, that's not true. It's got to work for you if it worked for me. Well, I'm not going to sit here and argue with anybody. I'm just going to be the best me that I can be. And I think that has helped me to be the success that I am. I even doubted success at one time. Am I successful? Uh, someone on Facebook put yesterday that they, you know, people have conversations about us in the background sometimes. You know, your friends will get together and you'll find out later through another friend that your friends are talking about you and saying, wow, she should have lost more. She should be skinny by now. I've, I've had that all, all of my journey, you know, or, or it's vice versa. Man, I'm so proud of her. She successfully has kept it off and has stayed healthy because for the most part, people wanted to see me healthy. People wanted me to live a long life. Uh, a quality of life is what I call it. It's been a, it's been a wonderful, successful quality of life. Uh, I wrote a few things down. Stopping the hating I was not good enough. I wasn't good enough because I wasn't doing it your way or her way or his way. <laughs> um, that just became ridiculous after a while. Uh, for me, it was more than just what they did to my stomach. I needed to balance it out with my mind and my soul. Things needed to balance out because it wasn't successfully balancing out as a whole package for me at one time. Uh, and you know, if we do go up a few pounds, it's not the end of the world. Remember the, how far you came or how far you have come. For so many of us, if we go up 10 or 20 pounds, it's like all of a sudden we failed. Well, hello, I'm here to tell you that I lost over 300 pounds. That is not a failure. That is a success that I have kept it off. But for some of us, and I will always point my finger to me first. I hope you guys can hear me because the cars are going by. But, you know, that is so sad that I, that I read comments on Facebook or, or even hear people making videos of feeling like failures. You need to go back and remember how far you have traveled the road. And I don't care if it's only been 20 pounds. You traveled those 20 pound road. That was a road that you traveled, that you made yourself successful to lose those pounds. That takes a lot. Most of us need to change our minds to change the body, right? A good friend of mine, Robbie, Rob Reno says that on a daily basis. We've got to change the mind to change the body. And not until we change it can we feel successful. I know that maybe I am not answering quite what the question was. It was, 
how do you define success? Well, this is the way I, I define it. And what are some of your key factors? These are my key factors that have led and continue to lead your success. Maybe I should have answered it with uh, uh, a diet that I do, uh, a, a food plan, uh, so many other things, right? But for me, uh, I want to tear up, I want to cry because I believe that in 10 years, I've given myself growth worth living a chance to succeed in the journey that I chose for myself. Because I chose weight loss surgery to get out of the hole that I was in. I needed someone to get, hand me a rope and lead me out of the hole. So for me, success, number one, is that I've learned that my journey was mine and only mine. And that doing it the best that I can is what's going to get me even to a further success. I love you guys. Make it a wonderful day. And uh, go out and be the best you that you know how to be. And I'll see you when I see you. Bye.